We're on top of breaking news in Greensboro, where most Greensboro Transit Agency bus operations have been suspended due to a lack of bus drivers. We do know GTA Paratransit is back in operation after initially being down this morning as well. So WFMY News 2 Sydney Moore is live at the bus depot downtown, where Sydney, some drivers are waiting for their buses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's absolutely right. In just a minute, you'll hear from a, one man who is waiting to get on the bus. Now, we spoke with bus drivers who agreed to stand down today due to wanting their salary and benefits met. In fact, they say they don't plan to roll out until someone from the city sits down with them to negotiate contracts. And they say they are willing to take this as far as it will go. Megan and Tracy, Eric, I came here earlier this morning around 7 this morning. There were dozens of people standing around waiting on a bus to get to work. Some were waiting longer than others. I spoke with one man who got here around 630 this morning to get to work. Here's what he has to say. I get it, but the frustration comes from the lack of communication, really. Um, I feel like when everybody got on the bus, there should have been a you know, just a little bit of heads up of, hey, you know, you might not want to get on the bus today, something like that. And, you know, we see the same drivers every day, so like it kind of sucks that there's no communication. You know, and so some people were frustrated. Others are understanding with what's going on. And just to clarify again, the paratransit is up and running and we will continue to stay around here as this story continues to develop at this time. Live in Guilford County, I'm Sydney Moore, WFMY News 2. All right, thank you, Sydney, and welcome to the Good Morning Show at 9 a.m. Eric Chilton here with Tracy McCain, Megan Larris, and Christian Morgan. Good morning.